Mathematics class for first standard. Children, this is your Nitra mom from Mangala Vidya Mandira. Children, in the previous class we learnt about addition. In this class we will learn about subtraction. Subtraction is the difference between any two numbers. The symbol of subtraction is minus. The terms which imply subtraction are how many left, how many more, how many less than, the difference of. Children, now we will do subtraction. Here we have apples. How many apples are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 apples are there. Here, which number should be subtract? 3 from 7. So, we will remove 3 apples. After removing 3 apples, how many apples are remaining? 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 apples are remaining. So, we will write 4. Therefore, 7 minus 3 is equals to 4. Children, here we have shirts. How many shirts are there? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. There are 6 shirts. Here which number should be subtract? 3 from 6. So we will remove 3 shirts with flower. After removing 3 shirts, how many shirts are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3. 3 shirts are remaining. So we will write 3. Therefore, 6 minus 3 is equals to 3. Children, see this picture. What are these? These are birds. How many birds are there in the first picture? There are 2 birds in the first picture. So we will write 2 in the first box. In the second picture, one bird flew away. So we will write one in the second box. Now, how many birds are remaining in the third picture? One bird is left out. So we will write one in the next box. Therefore, two minus one is equals to one. Children, here pot is there. In this pot, five flowers are there. A girl comes and plucks two flowers. Now how many flowers are remaining? Let us count it. One, two, three. Three flowers are remaining. Therefore, five minus two is equals to three. Children, see this picture. What is this? This is a pond. There are ducks in it. Five ducks are there. No ducks moves away. 5 minus 0 is equals to 5. Children, here we have flowers. How many flowers are there? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 flowers are there. 3 flowers are colored and 3 flowers are not colored. Now we will take away the colored flowers. After taking away the colored flowers, how many flowers are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3. 3 flowers are remaining. So, 6 minus 3 is equals to 3. Children, here we have circles. How many circles are there? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 circles are there. 3 circles are colored and 4 circles are not colored. Now we will take away the colored circles. After taking away the colored circles, how many circles are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 circles are remaining. So, 7 minus 3 is equals to 4. Children, here we have stars. How many stars are there? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 stars are there. 5 stars are colored and 3 stars are not colored. 
Now we will take away the colored stars. After taking away the colored stars, how many stars are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3. 3 stars are remaining. So 8 minus 5 is equals to 3. Children, here we have leaves. How many leaves are there? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 leaves are there. 6 leaves are colored and 3 leaves are not colored. Now we will take away the colored leaves. After taking away the colored leaves, how many leaves are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3. 3 leaves are remaining. So, 9 minus 6 is equals to 3. Children, now we will solve some problems. See the first question. 3 minus 1. Here first we have 3. So, we will draw 3 lines. Next we have 1. So, we will cut 1 line. Now, how many lines are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2. 2 lines are remaining. So, we will write 2. Therefore, 3 minus 1 is equals to 2. Children, see the next question. 6 minus 4. Here, first which number we have? First we have 6. So, we will draw 6 lines. Next we have 4. So, we will cut 4 lines. Now, how many lines are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2. 2 lines are remaining. So, we will write 2. Therefore, 6 minus 4 is equals to 2. Children, in this question we have 7 minus 0. Which number we have first? We have first 7. So, we will draw 7 lines. Next, we have 0. 0 means nothing. So, we should not cut any lines. So, 7 minus 0 is equals to 7. Children, see this question. 5 minus 2. Here, first we have 5. So, we will draw 5 lines. Next we have 2. So we will cut 2 lines. Now how many lines are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3. 3 lines are remaining. So we will write 3. Therefore 5 minus 2 is equals to 3. Children, in the next question we have 9 minus 1. What is 9 minus 1? Let us find out. Here we have first 9. So we will draw 9 lines. Next we have 1. So we will cut 1 line. Now how many lines are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 lines are remaining. So, 9 minus 1 is equals to 8. Children, see the next question. 8 minus 3. What is 8 minus 3? Let us find it out. Here, which number we have first? Yes, we have first 8. So, we will draw 8 lines. Next, we have 3. So, we will cut 3 lines. Now, how many lines are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 lines are remaining. So, we will write 5. Therefore, 8 minus 3 is equals to 5. Children, see the next question. 4 minus 0. What is 4 minus 0? Let us find it out. Here, first we have 4. So, we will draw 4 lines. Next, we have 0. 0 means nothing. So, we should not cut any lines. 4 minus 0 is equals to 4. So, we will write 4. Children, now we should subtract the numbers on the left side. 
and match the answers with the number on the right side. First question is 7 minus 2. We will represent it by fingers. The first number is 7. So here we have 7 fingers. The second number is 2. So we will fold 2 fingers. Now how many fingers are left? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 fingers are left. So we will write 5. Therefore 7 minus 2 is equals to 5. In second question we have 9 minus 1. The first number is 9. So here we have 9 fingers. The second number is 1. So we will fold 1 finger. Now how many fingers are left? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 fingers are left. So we will write 8. So the difference of 9 and 1 is 8. In the third question we have 8 minus 5. The first number is 8. So we have 8 fingers. The second number is 5. So we will fold 5 fingers. Now, how many fingers are left? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3. 3 fingers are left. So, we will write 3. So, the difference of 8 minus 5 is 3. In the fourth question, we have 3 minus 1. The first number is 3. So, here we have 3 fingers. The second number is 1. So, we will fold 1 finger. Now, how many fingers are left? 1, 2, 2 fingers are left. So we will write 2. 3 minus 1 is equals to 2. In the last question we have 6 minus 5. The first number is 6. So here we have 6 fingers. The second number is 5. So we will fold 5 fingers. Now how many fingers are left? 1 finger is left. So we will write 1. Therefore 6 minus 5 is 1. Now we should match the answers in the right side. The first answer is 5. In the right side where is 5? Yes it is here. So we will match these two numbers. In the second one the answer is 8. In the right side where is 8? Yes it is here. So, we will match these two numbers. In the third one, the answer is 3. In the right side, where is 3? Yes, it is here. So, we will match these two numbers. In the fourth one, the answer is 2. In the right side, where is 2? Yes, it is here. So, we will match these two numbers. In the fifth one, the answer is 1. In the right side, where is 1? Yes, it is here. So, we will match these two numbers. Children, children, now we will write the missing numbers. Children, in this question, we have 8 minus 2 equals to dash. What is 8 minus 2? Here, first we have 8. So, we will draw 8 lines. Next, we have 2. So, we will cut 2 lines. Now how many lines are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 lines are remaining. So the missing number is 6. The next question is 7 minus dash equals to 5. Here what is the answer? Yes, 5 is the answer. Here the question is 7 and answer is 5. To get the answer, we should subtract 5 from 7. So, we will draw 7 lines for it. We have 5 in our answer. So, we will cut 5 lines. Now, how many lines are remaining? Let us count it. 1, 2. 2 lines are remaining. So, the missing number is 2. Therefore, 7 minus 2 is equals to 5. The next question is dash minus 2 equals to 4. Here we want our answer to be 4. We have draw 4 lines for it. We have 2 in our question. So we will draw 2 more lines. 
Now, totally how many lines are there? Let us count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Totally 6 lines are there. So, the missing number is 6. Therefore, 6 minus 2 is equals to 4. The next question is dash minus 0 is equals to 8. Here we want our answer to be 8. We have draw 8 lines for it. We have 0 in our question. 0 means nothing. So we will not cut any lines. So the missing number is 8. Therefore 8 minus 0 is equals to 8. Children subtract the following sums and complete the textbook page number 83, 84 and 85. And subtract and match these problems. Children, copy all the sums from video to classwork.